Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm doing your uh, second week of September reading starting from the uh, 8th through the 14th of uh, September 2019. This is going to be for the sign of Scorpio. So let's see what's coming up for Scorpions for this week, which has already started today. Let's see. Seven of Cups, The Fool, Page of Pentacles, and Ten of Pentacles. Underneath the deck, you do have the Moon. Underneath that, the Sun. Underneath that, Ten of, Pen uh, ten of Cups. Underneath that, Seven of Wands. Underneath that, Strength and Two of Pentacles. Somebody is definitely not sure of what they want to do. They really want to work towards their happiness. They really want that, but they don't know what are the steps they need to take. What are the things that they need to get clear about to go in the right direction at the right time as well? Because I do see uh, delays. I do see um, uncertainty. Um, I do see lack of uh, clarity as well. And there are, there are lots of things that that is on their mind uh, it could be you it, that there are lots of things on your mind and you don't know what to do uh, first um, you're thinking a lot you it's, it's more like you know somebody who's thinking a lot doing nothing is what I'm picking up very strongly you really want to be happy you really want to be successful you really want to work, make things work be that in your relationship or your work life but in actuality, you are not doing or you are not putting any effort to make things work. You really have to understand that to get what you want, you really have to take at least the first baby step towards it. If you don't take any step, then you are not going to get what you want. So you really need to understand that. You really need to have that clarity that things like, you know, nothing in the world can help you with it, with the situation that you are in right now. Um, if it's like you know if, if you enter a room and there are so many things in the room nobody is going to make you help see something that that um they want you to see until and unless you want to see that too like you know if somebody tells you okay look at there like you know keep, get your focus to that you know a sofa or a chair in the uh, in that particular room they cannot make you see that until and unless you put in the effort to see you know uh, to Switching your focus from something else to that chair or sofa, whatever it is they want you to focus on. So it's more like, you know, people can guide you. People can, you know, uh, tell you a way to find, you know, uh, to get out of the situation. But only you can do what, what you need to do. And I do see that um, you really need to steer clear from those clouds that you are, you know, engulfed in right now. Confusions, um, disappointments, uncertainties. Uh, you know, confused um, decisions, um, not confused decisions, but pending decisions. It's, it's more like, you know, you yourself um, making yourself feel like, you know, you have a lot of things to do. You're not taking action towards, you know, um, getting done with one thing at a time. You're just being re relaxed and lethargic as well. And you need to get it very clear that you have to put in the effort otherwise you are going to pile up more and more things in your life to deal with and you are not going to get anything dealt with so just be mindful of that let's see some more clarifiers for the situation coming up for you for this week because i do see um you really need to have a clarity have a vision and go for it Without thinking what is going to happen next, when this will happen, why this is not happening, you really need to put your thought out there. Universe is going to help you find the ways to deal with it. But you really have to take the first step. Just take the first, you know, um, baby step towards something at least because you are not going to come out of it otherwise. There's lack of balance in your life, lack of concentration, lack of um, clarity, vision, because you're not balanced right now at all. 
there's, you know, there's no alignment there. And that too, because maybe you, you are so, um, it's, you're getting anxious, but at the same time, you're not trying to work things out. You're not making the moves that you need to make. So let's see what the Page of Pentacles is all about. You feel like if I if I take one step right now, it's going to affect the other areas of your life too. So sh shall I take it or shall I just move on to the next step? When you go to the next step, you feel like if I deal with this, maybe I'll have to deal with that too. So it's like, you know, there is a web of, uh, you know, thoughts. One web leads to another web of thoughts. The other web leads to another web of thoughts. So it's like you have completely, you know, um, confused yourself mentally. And that's why I said you really need to have a clear picture, at least mentally, so you could go after that thought, after that idea, after that mental image that you have. Because you really need to do that. And... Um, <clears throat> Yeah, you just you just need to do that. It's it's something that you cannot. Um, it's something that you cannot deal with, but it's just that you're not ready to deal with things. Is what I'm picking up very strongly here. So once you have made that mind, once you have, it's it's more like you know fighting with your own self. That you know telling yourself that this is what I want, and then going after that. Um, so it's it's more like you know you really have to take the plunge and see how it goes like i do see there is success i do see there is going to be some blessings coming your way if you could just take the first baby step but if you fail to do that then this is exactly what's going to come for you for the remaining month uh, from for the remaining month maybe for some of you yeah but for the remaining part of the week as well you are going to stay here where you are in the beginning of the week you really need to to reach this part, you really have to go through this. You really have to take that baby step and then see how things goes. But um, only you can do that. Only you can bring yourself out of this web of illusions and um, thoughts and whatever. It's, it's like, you know, you have created this mess. Only you can clear it. So just deal with it. Just clear the mess and so you could have the life that you want. Because... This is your goal. This is what you desire. This is what you want to have. But only you can clear this path. Only you can clear the path for yourself to reach this goal of yours. So just do the right things at the right time. Because it's like, you know, delaying things is going to keep you stuck here. So if you don't want to stay stuck, don't stay lethargic. Just make the first move. Do the things that you need to do to get out of it. So yeah, that's pretty much it coming up for you for this uh, week. If the reading resonates with you, do like, subscribe, and share. If you're willing to get a personal reading, you can always reach out to me for that on my email ID in the description box. Till I do the next reading for you people, take care. Bye-bye.